Today we're going to be looking at uh, solubility and dissolvability of uh, a variety of products that often find their ways into the wastewater collection system uh, and demonstrate a little bit on how some of these products can negatively impact the operation of the system, possibly leading to blockages which can interrupt service or even lead to wastewater overflows. So uh, what we have here is uh, a setup of a variety of different types of uh, non-woven fabric materials, uh, baby wipe material, it's actually labeled as flushable, uh, even as it's stirred around, still maintaining its uh, integrity. One of the notable things about the floss is you'll notice how it gets wrapped around the axle of the paddle. Um, that actually is very indicative of what happens in the pumps as, as these products flow into one of our pump stations. Uh, Q-tips, obviously, are uh, uh, plastics just uh, maintaining in the system as if nothing's ever happened. Our, our single ply toilet tissue is already starting to break down a little bit. Um, our, our facial tissue is uh, starting to get a little looser and our, our double ply toilet tissue is also starting to break down a little bit. When these items are put into uh, water or flush down uh, the sewer system, how even when they mix up, some things break down and therefore are easily transmitted and uh, treated at the treatment plant, and some things don't. And when they don't, that's what can get bind up pumps, uh, create blockages in pipes, and create problems that result in either increased costs to operate and maintain the system, which is translates into higher rates for the utility customers, or worse yet, blockages that result in overflows. While it may not appear that any one flushable wipe or uh, dental floss may cause a problem, when you extrapolate the concept that the department serves 100,000 customers and a population of over a half million people, if everybody puts just one thing down there, it adds up pretty quick. So you're being more uh, of a good steward for the environment if you actually put those products in the trash can rather than down the, the toilet, even though the label may say flushable.